What is the name of Jesus Christ? Jesus means that he is the savior. No, he's saved, not savior. This is a fundamental mistake many Trinitarians make. You shall call his name Jesus, Mary was told, because no, he You shall call his name Emmanuel. You will call... No, no, no. Not Yahweh. No, no, no. Yes. No, no, no. You're talking about Isaiah and Matthew. I'm, I'm talking Matthew. Matthew is quoting call, Isaiah. You will call his name Jesus because he will save his people from their sins. That's what Gabriel said to Mary. I think you really have to... Because what you're doing now, you're, you probably heard it from someone. No, no, no. Without doing any research, Listen, the name... I am 73. It doesn't I've matter. the Bible for 60 years. My friend, it doesn't matter. I am a missionary. And it I doesn't know. matter, my friend. Listen, I know what I'm saying. You no, no, it. No, it's not I me can, denying it. You are I can show you the, the references for the meaning of the term Yeshua from the Hebrew lexicons. Okay? Jesus, Yeshua, means the, the saved by Yah, saved by God, Yahweh. Yes, go and look it up. Okay, let's see if you read your Bible. Okay, so according to you, God is the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yes. Am I right? Yes. According to Jesus, who is the only true God? According to Jesus Christ, God. who is the only true God? Who? From these three, who is the only true God? God. No, no. I'm asking you, from the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. He is all three. The only true yeah. God. According to Jesus, not according to you. We have already established that according to you, it's all three. According to Jesus, it's all three. Okay. Let's see if you read your Bible. John 17, 3. When Jesus says, the only true God is the Father, can it be referring to anyone other than the Father? I is referencing to God. No, he's, he says who the God is. He says the Father. So when he says the only true God is the Father, can it be referring to anyone else as the only true God? The Father is priority in, in sending the Son. That was my question. And the Son. When Jesus is saying the only true God is the Father, can he mean and can he refer to anyone other than that's what he says? The only thing that the Bible tells us. Oh, that's the only thing Jesus confirms about the Father. He also says that no man knows the Father except the Son. Yes, and exactly. No man knows the Son except the Father. Exactly. You see, because he knows the Father better than you and me, yes, he confirms. Wait, wait, wait. Because he knows that knowledge about the Father, he confirms that he is the only true God. So somebody knowing the Father as he's known is as the only true God is equal to being God Himself. No, knowing no, God no, no. God, no, that's not true. The Father knowing Him. That's not true at all. So you're telling me if you know your father, your biological father, that means you are your father. In, in not not in, in human terms. Exactly. So we know, but knowing God fully and being known by God fully is a claim to deity. By the way, he never said he knew God fully. Did he know the hour? Did Jesus know the hour? Well, if there is an hour. No, the end time, the last hour. If there is an hour. Mark 13, 32. Nobody knows the hour. Not the angels in heaven. Not the sun. Except the Father in heaven. That doesn't mean the hour is set. No, but who knows the hour? Who knows the hour based on that statement? You said you're a missionary. You said you've read the Bible.